Hey there, folks. So today I'm going to be looking at a character mod, and over the course of my Don't Starve series I've played with a few of them, ranging from Squidward to Shrek, for instance. So this video is going to be no different. Okay, well I guess it'll be a little different. Yeah, I saw this mod in the Steam Workshop for this game, and I couldn't not pick it up. Like, you get to play as the Berger, you do it! So, mod info will be in the video description if you'd like to pick it up for yourself. But yeah, this should be good. But will it be as good as that one Shrek mod? I mean, Shrek does talk about his butt crack an awful lot, so that's kind of a high bar to hurdle. Oh, look at that. Ooh, I feel like telling the Berger he doesn't look so good is just asking for trouble. Yeah, sure, I'll pick a flower. Oh, wow, that was the angriest flower picking I've ever seen. I was about to say, hey, the Berger's got a soft spot. But he is furious, and I can't seem to break anything. Yeah, give me them twigs. <laughs> So do I have to, like, craft a little axe for him to be able to cut down a tree with? Because if that's the case, that will be adorable. Man, the Berger's got some rage problems. It's just a tuft of grass. It's fine. Yeah, let's, uh, let's get to crafting. I... Oh, doesn't seem to work. Oh, but I see... Huh. Oh, okay. So this... Oh, my goodness. <laughs> well, I think I figured out how to break stuff. Oh, and he's going in for a big old bear hug. Okay, so it seems like the hammer and the spear probably just do the same thing. I like how, in true bear fashion, he's starting off with honey, too. Oh, and holding down spacebar uh, doesn't quite work out. Gah, I don't know which one to pick up first! This indecision is crippling! Alright, let's just take this feather. So Hollywood is pretty big into reboots these days, and I feel like this is basically the gritty reboot of Winnie the Pooh. Oh, d d d dearie dear, Pooh got real mean real fast. But I think it was pretty inevitable. Christopher Robin called him a silly old bear one too many times, and this is the end result, tragically. Oh, well, sorry, guys. Oh, I'm making Krampus a little mad. Well, it wasn't my intention to kill you. I just wanted to break the rock. Krampus seems to be getting a little cross with me. Well, we'll see about that. Krampus! I feel like the realistic thing here would be Krampus sees the Berger and just immediately turns around. He's like, I don't care how naughty this guy's being, I'm not getting paid enough for this. Oh, did you just steal some of my grass? That's it, Krampus, you are dead. Ah, Krampus is a spry little bugger. <laughs> but not especially smart. Now, let's just loot the body. Very angrily still. This was a crime of passion after all, so I wouldn't really expect anything less. Okay, I think it's time we calm down a little bit. Krampus is dead, he can't bother us anymore. Oh, I can't go in the wormhole? That makes me kinda mad. Mad enough for another rampage! Ah, I can't believe this friggin' wormhole won't- No, it's fine. <laughs> Gonna go for a nice casual stroll down the road, don't mind me. Oh, <laughs> I 
Okay. Yeah, I was wondering how that was going to work. So I can't put down a campfire. But it doesn't matter, because the Berger is just naturally bioluminescent. Who knew? Well, I think it's time to celebrate our good fortune with some victory, honey. Delicious. Oh, don't you give me that sass, spider. You get your own victory, honey. After the day I've had, I am not in the mood. Alrighty, so one thing I've always wondered is which of the giants is the strongest? And sure, you could be logical about it and say, oh, you know, just whatever one has the most attack, or like the most health. And yeah, that's one way of doing it. But I would argue that really the only way to be sure is to hold some kind of impromptu Thunderdome. So let's do that. I'm a little rusty on my console command, so I might have to look this up, though. No. Okay. One sec. Now, this Thunderdome is going to be a little different. It's going to be less two giants enter, one giant leaves, and more five giants enter, one giant leaves. Again, the only way to be sure. I actually had an idea for a video like this a while back, where instead of playing as the Berger, I was just going to be Wilson and have the Giants duke it out in an arena I made. I had even recorded a deathmatch between all of them, only I, I kind of wanted to do more takes of the fight, and I the arena got trashed, basically, and it took a long time to make, so I was like, you know what? Never mind. But this is the next best thing, basically. And so I figure we got all the, the heavy hitters here, but let's throw in a wild card or say 30 and get some pigs in the fray. Let's get ready to rumble! Oh, jeez. Oh, no. <laughs> the pigs were like stunlocking me. <laughs> All right, let's. That's enough of that. Ooh, deer clops down for the count. And Krampus, come on, man. Nobody invited you. God, what a buzzkill. Looks like the ancient guardian's holding his own against the remaining pigmen. But can he hold his own against the Berger? And the dragonfly. Oh, guess not. Oh, and there he goes. <laughs> oh, not gonna let me open it normally, huh? Well, I have other means of opening chests. Thank you very much. Oh. <laughs> nice. The bitch has got ice powers. Oh, and I can wear armor, too. Ah, uh, and the one surviving pig man. Claudius, you're either incredibly brave or incredibly foolish to take on a Berger who's just now discovered his latent ice powers. Oh boy. Well, we got a real David and Goliath story right here, folks. I think I have to put a stop to this. I was going to make a joke where I was going to let Claudius kill me and be like, oh, turns out that Claudius the pig man is really the king of the giants, as everyone suspected. But this has taken way too long. I've already been here for like a full minute, and at this rate, I'm just going to be here all day. So, what's that? Oh, it's 50 of Claudius's friends, all conveniently here to beat me up. Oh, is that it? There's no... <laughs> there's no death animation, it's just the Berger standing there in shock that he was bested by pigs, all their tiny little hooves pummeling him to death. He never would have believed it. Is this really how he's gonna go out? But yeah, there we have it. Claudius wins the Thunderdome. 
He's got the heart of a champion, so honestly, I'm not surprised that his heroism rallied pigs across the land to fight beside him. But that about wraps it up. Thanks for watching.